So now we'd like to add a dynamic marking to our piece. We go up here, we can select the first note of the piece. Just selected the note. We go up to Create, down to Text. There are two of the, the two most important types of staff text, as it's called, are expression text and technique text. It just so happens that dynamic markings are under expression text. So now we have a cursor to enter some text that has just shown up right here. We can either type something in or we can control click, hold down the control key, click, and it brings up a menu of a bunch of possibilities that we can just select. So we can select mezzo forte, but just note while we're here how many other things there are that we can select as expressions. These are all considered expressions and many of them are smart and can affect the playback. For example, so we select mezzo forte and now it knows that we'd like to play this at a certain volume level. We can, if we want, we can pull this down so that we have a little more room to put it right underneath the music.